And here's me, Skullja1, with another review from Predator, from NECA's Predator 2 line. We're gonna, today we're going to be reviewing the Boar Predator. Um, let's start with the packaging, basic packaging. Uh, you got the bio of the City Hunter on the side. Uh, boar Predator up there. Predator 2, Boar Predator, and a picture of the boar. Over 25 points of articulation includes smart disc accessory. On the back, there's a picture of the boar. Now, from what I see in the picture, this picture right here, I actually like this look a lot better than the one they, that's pictured. Uh, I like the sort of yellow hue that they gave it, along with the orange lining. The one that I'm going to review, it seems more of a, a sort of brown, like an orange. Uh, boar Predator, Predator 2. Aliases, not known. Weapons, throwing disc. The Lost Hunters, a clan shrouded in mystery. Travelers of both time and space. The Predators exist to hunt, and they adhere to a strict code of honor where defeat is all equal to death. Also available, available the Shaman, the uh, City Hunter, and the Boar. Uh, let's get this guy open, and I'll be back in a minute. Stay tuned. And we're back. Uh, let's just review the uh, paint like we did with the City Hunter first. Um, he's got a white hue to his body, and then he's got orange abdomen linings. Uh, I'm sorry, did I say abdomen? Ab linings. Um, the, they, they stayed consistent with this paint job because it's the same uh, color as the torso. The legs have cool tiger stripes, which are darker with more of a red uh, tint. His uh, armor is all one color. It's a sort of iron chrome and then his feet this is what I like the most it's it's almost like a um, it's kind of like a leopard Have you guys ever seen a um, like a tiger shark it, it, it's kind of like a tiger shark I've, I've always admired the uh, the paint jobs that uh, they've they did for predator 2 I, I just thought they were really beautiful and they had more of a significance to them the uh, his wep his sh gauntlets actually do not have any blades. They're sort of just well gauntlets. He's got shoulder armor, which is the typical Predator Two shoulder armor. And then this shoulder armor has not been featured before. It's a uh, it's sort of like a double sh uh, shoulder piece where it sort of overlaps. The back netting the netting is visible, and they did a nice job in keeping it aligned. His uh, trophies include this little set of tiny trophies. Uh, there's the crocodile looking head, the mouse and squirrel head, and this really weird ass head. I don't know what it is, but it's cool. I like it. Um, the dreads back there, he's got very nice bronze dread beads. And if you can see, his crown, the top of the head, include it's like almost like a like a magma red. It's very cool. The mask is very nice too. The indication of why he's called boar is very apparent. Uh, you can see the sort of boar nostrils. And then up here on his forehead, the, the sort of gold wash comes out. I really like it. The articulation, he has a ball jointed waist. Nice. Uh, he's got a uh, hinge jointed uh, elbow, a hinge jointed shoulder, a ball jointed hand, a uh, ball jointed uh, crotch, and then double jointed um, double jointed knees. Double jointed knees. Very nice. And the feet are ball joint. I really actually like this figure. I think I like it a little bit more than the. Um, then the City Hunter, he stands up pretty well, but because of the uh, the ball jointed crotch, he sort of slips away. So you have to position him just right. But once you do, it's perfect. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to give him a nine. Uh, I wish he would have come up with a little more accessories, even though they don't. Uh, he didn't really feature with that many accessories. But still, I just the one disc is a little ridiculous. But you know they tried to stay screen accurate, so I appreciate that. Uh, he's got his pouch right there. It's all r rubbery leather. 
His loincloth is also a rubber, and he's got his cover piece right there. Now, what makes the City Hunter better is that the City Hunter sort of had his uh, cover in front, and then underneath he had a crotch protector. Here he just sort of has this rubber uh, little cover over it, which doesn't really uh, seem, sig signify much. The back detailing is very nice. He's got red splotches all over him. I just wish they would have given him like a back loincloth thing. Uh, you can see his thong. You can actually see his thong, yes. Uh, it's right there. And then his leather straps cover it. They actually gave him some pretty cool spiky studs sticking out. If you can see them by the side. They gave, they, they gave him some pretty cool spikes. And that's about it. Can you take off the heads like you can the other ones? Yeah, you actually can't take off the heads, which is pretty cool. But, uh, yeah. Oh, and the dread consistency is pretty nice. They're all single-stranded. And, yeah. And then his uh, neck brace is the basic black neck brace. Thanks for watching. On today's review, we're reviewing the NECA... Um, Boar Predator from Predator from Predator Two. Uh, I'm Skullja One, and I'll bring you the next review of the Shaman. Thanks.